Last time the delivery truck showed up with our fuselage kit, they literally dropped it out of the back of the truck. I wonder how they're gonna do delivering our tail kit. Stay tuned, we'll let you know. What you looking at there? Oh, the beginnings of researching and planning on building an aircraft. Standard aircraft handbook for mechanics and technicians. This is a really helpful book for when you're about to start building a RV. Yeah, funny how uh, Van sent it to us in our second kit. But technically the first kit. That is true. So, <clears throat> news this week is the tail kit showed up. Whoop, whoop. So, our tail kit showed up uh, yesterday. Yes. We've got parts of it here. The rest of our tail kit is going to be stored in our guest room for how long? I don't know. A couple months until um, we start building the tail kit. Yeah. So, if you're planning on coming to visit us and you think you're staying in just a normal guest room, <laughs> Joke's on you. It's airplane Aviation themed. themed. <laughs> so this is our practice kit. Um, and we've been working on the fuselage kit. We're going to cover a lot more details on what we've done and haven't done on the fuselage kit in uh, a video, another video that's coming up. But our tail kit arrived. Now, go watch our first video of when the fuselage kit arrived. Not our favorite driver in the world. He creatively got it out of the truck. That's what I want right there. There we go. I didn't damage nothing, I hope. I don't think so. That's the way I can get it off right there. Yep. You gotta let it work. Is that what you're gonna call it? Yes. Okay. What are the chances that the same driver would deliver our second kit? Yep, Rocky came back. <laughs> Did a much better job this time. Um, we told him we're going to do this differently. Uh, luckily, Melissa was here. Uh, I think he was scared of you. Uh, maybe that was it, because I told him I was there to supervise. Yeah, so uh, honestly, the tail kit was a slightly bigger box than I was expecting. It was longer, but not as thick. Not as thick. Uh, still 240 pounds is what they said. Mm -hmm. I still think 100 and something of it is just the uh, the crate itself. Probably. But uh, delivery went super smooth. It was probably 10 minutes from the time we saw the truck drive by and park to he was leaving. Yeah. The pieces in it were super long. Um, I was not expecting so many big pieces. Yes. Yeah, we so. thought the fuselage where we're going to sit in would have the bigger pieces. This is the biggest piece of the fuselage. The tail kit has much bigger pieces, but yeah. I'll admit, I had a surreal moment as we were carrying parts of the airplane into the house. <laughs> I'm starting to see pieces that legitimately look like an airplane, and this is starting to feel less like a practice kit, and like something we're actually going to fly here in a couple of years. Um, that is the plan. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I... Vans did send us another practice kit, though. Oh, they did? Yeah, in the tail kit. Yes. How I... nice of them. It was so cute after getting this far into the fuselage kit that we get the how-to book and another practice kit, which is a great little practice kit. It's a piece of aluminum. You're putting nut plates and rivets and countersink. You do, like, one of everything in it. Great practice. Yeah, we're beyond that. <laughs> uh, I think we're going to save that practice kit for when friends come over and they want to do something creative. 
Uh, we can show them that, but then have them actually do something real on an airplane that's going to fly. We've already got a couple of signed rivets on our airplane. Yes. Thank you to all of our friends who've been coming over and participating in the build. It's been a lot of fun. Yes. So inventory of the, uh, the tail kit. We got through inventory a lot less than the fuselage kit, but we had a few missing pieces and then a few on back order. Yep. So. so we got to send an email to Vans. Nothing that seems critical. We haven't really looked at the instructions yet because it's going to be, we're going to get as far in the fuselage kit before we go back to the tail kit as we can. So uh, as long as we do the inventory, get the parts that we need, it's nothing's going to block us. Yeah. So okay. we'll, 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 we'll see how that goes. But um, I said, we only spent... We did like an hour and a half session to start inventory, broke for dinner, uh, met some friends, came back and finished the inventory, all the inside parts. Yeah. We, smart move. Uh, word of warning or a piece of advice for anybody doing inventory, take what you can inside and inventory in the air conditioning, especially if you're building in the Texas summer. You'll thank me for that one. So all the rivets and uh, nuts and bolts and small parts we did at the dining room table, all the big pieces we did in the guest room, both air conditioned. Um, and only what's behind us remained in the garage, a lot of the sub kits uh, that we inventoried here. So pretty straightforward. Um, I, any bets on how long the fuselage kit will take us once we start? The fuselage? I'm sorry, the tail kit. Okay, the tail kit, a month. A month? Maybe two. Okay. I'm going with three months, uh, but we'll see. Uh, granted, we are now, are we two months into the fuselage now? E April, May, month, month and, and, a, and half. a half. Okay, so we're a month and a half in the fuselage kit. Uh, we're about to get to the exciting part where we start making it look like an airplane yeah we start putting all the bulkheads on the bottom skins and putting it all together so uh don't hold your breath waiting for our tail kit build that will be coming but um we will we will get to it we still got a lot of parts of over on the shelf over there for the fuselage that we need to get through um i'm happy that we did a slow build fuselage i i Heck, a lot better than waiting for the quick build to show up. Yeah, that's a lot of fun. Our quick build wings are, do you see our latest? Uh, pushed back to April 2023. Oh, no, it's January to April. So April 2023. So, April 2023. <laughs> so, we'll so we should plan for June 2023. I don't think even if it shows up in April, we'll be ready for it. Uh, you're so pessimistic. We'll see. We got a lot of work to do. Um, the other exciting thing about the tail kit was there's like wiring and lights and other stuff that like it's the fuselage was nothing but pieces of metal. There's nothing kind of airplane related in the fuselage kit. I mean, it's all airplane related. Yeah, but I, I think wiring like it's a, it's the start of a different skill set that we're going to start having to explore. Nerd. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. <laughs> Stay tuned as we start building the fuselage, or finish the fuselage and get to the tail kit. I'm so confused. It's just okay. an airplane, it's fine. 